Hey everybody, so in this video I'm just going to quickly go through how to add a link to an image within the website. Um, so by doing this you can actually add graphical buttons that look a little bit nicer than text links. So I'm in my uh, I'm in edit mode of my website, so you can see because I've got this edit bar across the top, I go to the page that I want to add the button to, so I just quickly go to the about page. I, uh, I select my edit button which will then throw the page into editing mode. Now there are two ways which we can add an image and add a link to it. So basically um, I'll go through the first way by, uh, by adding a new block of content. So on here I can add a new block of content and then I can scroll down to image so I can just add a plain image and on here I choose the image that I want to uh, want to add. So I've got a nice little button image that I've already uploaded. So I choose that from my uh, from my file manager. And now you can see here that I can choose to uh, link um, this image somewhere. So I can either link it to an internal page, so another page within my website. So if I choose another page within my website, I can select a page here, and then that comes up with my site map, and I can link it anywhere where I want to. So I'll just link that one to the um, Contact Us page. And then I hit Add. There is my button, which is huge at the moment, so I'll just quickly resize this. Just here, I'll make it about 200 pixels wide. That should be okay. There we go. So there's my button. I publish. So when I click that image now, that will take me through to the content contact us page on the website. So let me just go back for now and resize the image. Okay, so. If I want to link this page to another page uh, which is not connected to my website or is not an internal page within my website, I can do that by editing the image and changing my option here to an external URL. In this URL patch here, I can type in the website that I want it to link to. So I'm just going to link it to the 2XL website. When I'm finished, hit save. Hover over my um, edit button and publish my edits. And now when I click on that button, it's going to take me off this current website and take me through to a um, another website, uh, which is off, uh, which is an internal page. All right, so let me just go back again and I'll quickly run through the second way by which you can add a button to um, you know, an image or link, link a, a link to an image. So if I just throw this into edit mode again, I want to add a button within the text of this content block here. So I click on my edit button which will then open up my WYSIWYG editor which looks like a word processor. I put my cursor where I want the image to appear and the first thing I need to do is add my image. So I'm just going to click this button again and choose that. Now it's a big button once again so I'm just going to select the image, click my little image icon here and from here I can have a look at the appearance. I'm just going to change the size. So I'll make that around 200 pixels wide again. Now, under the advanced options in here, if I want to link this page to another page which is not um, on the website, so I want to link it to a page which is an, an internal page of my website, what I need to do is I need to select the image and then I select my link button up here. So now I'm going to attach a link to the button. 
I then type in the address I hit insert to save it and so now that's got the URL attached to that um, that image so there's my button I hover over and I publish and now what you'll notice is if I click that that image there it'll actually take me through to the 2XL website which I've linked it to so if I just quickly go back again the other thing that I can do is I can also link that page to an internal page within my own website so I do that by once again selecting that image I'll just break that link for now select that image once again and then I can add link or insert link to a page in here and then I can select the page that I want it to link to which would be the contact us hit save hover over my edit button hit publish and if I select or hit that button now it will actually take me through to the contact us page so that's how you add an image to the page and then add a link to the page as well so it will link to that uh, individual image so I hope you found that uh, informative and, um, and pretty straightforward. Thank you very much.